Hey everyone, I'm Keller, the CEO of Zipline, and we're here in one of our manufacturing facilities. Uh, right behind me, you can see Platform One Aircraft. So this is the first uh, technology platform that we built. We originally launched in Rwanda in 2016. Over the last eight years, the service has expanded from uh, 21 hospitals to over 4,000 hospitals and health facilities. We deliver 75% of the national blood supply of Rwanda. Uh, we deliver 18 million doses of vaccine over the last two years. Um, the service is really, really scaled, and the impact is also scaled. Uh, we've been able to reduce maternal mortality in Rwanda by 51% and then by 56% across the country of Ghana. So we really spent the last eight years perfecting Platform 1 and expanding, doing multiple block upgrades of this technology. You can see all these aircraft waiting to go out and begin make, making deliveries. You can also see a lot of the countries, uh, the flags of the countries that we serve uh, right behind me. We've also spent the last three years working on Platform 2. Uh, Platform 2 is our home delivery solution. And so uh, we just started building these aircraft earlier this year, and we're now scaling up production to uh, the point where Zipline will be able to do a million deliveries a day in the next couple of years. Right, right behind me, I actually have a Platform 2 aircraft that is going through maintenance here. Um, one of the cool things about Platform 2 is that we use an architecture uh, where we have a vertical takeoff and landing fixed wing vehicle, um, which is great because it can hover and land on the side of, of um, buildings that we're integrating with. But then we also use a droid on a line. The great thing about the droid is it enables us to deliver hyper, hyper accurately. We can deliver with dinner plate level accuracy, no matter what the weather is doing every single time. So this is kind of key to enabling this kind of technology to serve 99% of homes in the United States. We just started building this uh, about nine months ago. We've now scaled up full production in a facility that is about a half a mile away from where I, where I am right now. And we plan to build uh, many tens of thousands of these aircraft in the first full year of production. One last cool thing uh, to show you is over here. So here you can see a finished Platform 2 aircraft, um, but we can also see the loading portal. And this is one of the coolest things about how Platform 2 will work. Instead of requiring you know, us to take inventory of um, of medical products or any customer that we're working with, now we can basically just install onto the side of any pre-existing building. So whether it's a hospital or a primary care facility or a Walmart, uh, a warehouse, any retail store or even a restaurant, we can show up and in just about 24 hours, we can install an indoor loading portal. So here you can see the droid, which is normally lowered from the main aircraft. Uh, but installing this indoor loading portal means that um, anybody in the building, whether it's a, a Cleveland Clinic or Mayo Clinic employee or a Walmart employee, any, anybody in the building can take something. Here we actually have a bunch of kind of cool practice things that you can just load up if you want. Anybody can just take it, pop it into the droid, and load whatever you want into here. It's pretty, pretty large. It can carry eight pounds. Close the lid. And then once you scan the package here on the Zipline app, the droid does the rest. It will basically take that product, the droid will get retracted into the main zip, the zip will fly directly to the home that it needs to make a delivery to, and it'll deliver um, in a super accurate, quiet way every single time. What if instant delivery were 10 times as fast, half the cost, and zero emission? We think it's pretty cool to um, like imagine that future. It's going to be way better for uh, customers, it's also going to be way better for the environment. So this is why Zipline does what we do, and we're super excited for all of you to get to experience Platform 2 yourselves. Later.